My name is Omar al-Shogri, and as a child, I was detained alongside my cousins Bashir, Rashad, and Noor in 2012 by the Assad regime forces in Syria. Bashir, because of the torture, could not walk anymore. And that's the story of the last day with him. I was carrying Bashir to the bathroom, while the guards on the right side and the left side are torturing me and him. We come to the bathroom, he's there, and I just hear Bashir whispering, saying, Omar, I can't breathe anymore. I run, carry Bashir on my way back, and the guards keep him beating me and him. And at some point, I just felt Bashir's body is heavier, and I was weak. I could not carry him anymore. We fall both on the ground, and Bashir was dead. He died in my arms, and the guards were still beating his dead body. Today, in my nightmares, I still hear Bashir's voice screaming, saying to me, Omar, help me. I hear those prisoners who are still there being tortured every day. I hear them begging, screaming for help. You and I are the ones who can help. We should take that as a personal responsibility.